Hey guys, back here with Tua for another video. In this video, I plan to answer the question that I am asked most often when people see me with Tua, and I'm sure a lot of you Bull Mastiff owners can also relate to this one. It's not the, man, what does this poop look like? Save that one for a different video. It's actually the, oh man, how much do you feed that guy? Well, similar to last year around this time, after I had Tua for a year, I had kept track of all the numbers of um, how much raw food we were feeding him and also how much kibble. And I made a video last year very similar to this that uh, I went through and showed you guys exactly how much I fed him in that year. And that was from eight weeks to one year and eight weeks, one year of owning him. And now in year two, we're gonna go ahead and compare and contrast the numbers. I have everything added up from our second year of having Tua here. And we're gonna see how much more this guy ate in year two compared to year one. And it'll give anybody out there that has a bull mastiff or is interested in getting a bull mastiff an idea of exactly how much these guys eat in one year. So if you're interested in that or interested in bull mastiffs, go ahead, stick around. Okay guys, so like I said, I made a video like this around this time last year, give or take, on how much, how many pounds of food that he ate from the day we brought him home until a year later. So I wanted to do another updated one and compare and contrast because this one should be quite a bit more because obviously when he's a little young puppy, he's not eating as much as a full year of adulthood which I would consider kind of be from age one to age two. So we'll just go ahead and get right into the numbers here. For year one, he went through 11 bags of kibble that weighed 40 pounds. So he went through 440 pounds of kibble. Now keep in mind here that, well, first of all, if you're familiar with this channel at all, you know that I feed to a, um, a combination of kibble and raw meat. He is on a raw food diet for the most part, and as we've been going with him, we have been we have been slowly increasing that amount of raw food. Like right now, we're probably on like on any given day, like an 80 to 90 percent raw meat diet, with only you know 10 to 20 percent kibble, and sometimes I'll go days at a time where I'm only feeding him raw meals with no kibble added in at all. So the kibble was gonna be significantly more in the first year versus the second year. So like I said, first year kibble was 440 pounds versus year two, it was only 260 pounds of kibble. And the raw food for his first year was 161 pounds. And for the raw food for year one to two was 664 pounds. To put that into uh, a little bit of light and comparison here, the total amount of food that Tua ate in the first year that we had him combined was 601 pounds. So in the second year, we surpassed that in just raw food alone, 661 pounds. So that's pretty crazy. And then, uh, like I said, his total from the first year was 601 pounds, but his total for the second year between kibble and raw food was 924 pounds. So we'll go ahead and break that down a little bit further here um, with year one versus year two as well. With those totals from year one, that equaled about 50 pounds of food per month versus year two, 77 pounds of food per month. And then to break that down by the week, year one was 11.6 pounds per week. Year two was 17.7 .7 pounds per week. So that's quite a big increase there. And then we'll break that down a little bit further, go per day. Year one, he was doing about 1.7 pounds of food per day. And year two, he was doing about two and a half pounds of food per day. So that's quite a bit of food, guys. Um, to compare that, that's about the same size as a female buffalo or bison. That's pretty incredible um, that he <laughs> He ate an entire one of those in one year. 
Um, these increases are pretty significant. I'm definitely gonna keep track of this for at least one more year, year two to year three, because his weight should definitely level out now. And I, I feed him kind of based on um, how much he weighs. I'm, I'm generally, you know, two, three, four percent of his body weight um, of food per day is kind of my general rule of thumb that I feed him. So I would expect another increase, not as drastic as this, but another increase from year two to year three because his weight is going to be, you know, about where it is now. Where uh, um, in this last year, we've, we're gaining weight every single month. So that food percentage was going up every single month. But uh, yeah, kind of a fun video to make here. Break down and look at the numbers. If you guys have any questions for me, obviously go ahead, ask in the comments. Um, otherwise, guys, that's all I have for you on this food video. How much does a bull mastiff eat? And as always, take care.